Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Robin, and this is Adam, and we're from Coog Nation. Uh, we're here to kind of give you the our opinion on the state of Coog football right now. And one thing, we'll start with alumni, Ryan Leaf, yet again, getting in trouble twice in one week. It's, it's just become ridiculous now, Robin. I mean, I know, how do you, much. twice in one weekend, it's just an embarrassment to WSU, I think. It's very hypocritical. Yeah, he I came know. here last semester, you know, so you know, trying to support his book and promote, you know, being sober for right, so long. Right, right. And then this happens, and it's just like, what are you doing, man? What are you thinking? I know. How are you, how are you gonna preach to <laughs> kids in college of all age groups about being sober and doing all this, and then being caught not once but twice in the same week, just breaking into a house for oxycodone? I mean. I get it, an addiction is horrible to have and yeah. everything, but you have to be a role model if you're going to be a role model. You can't just be a role model for a month and then go against your word. I mean, it's just yeah, I completely it's embarrassing, agree. isn't I it? Think, yeah, it is embarrassing and yeah. it's completely hypocritical and it's, it's just so wrong on so many levels yeah. and it just does not represent Definitely. Washington State University well at all as a, you know, a Rose Bowl quarterback. Too. Yeah, number two just, pick in the NFL draft. Yeah, it's, it's, it's horrible. Just, not, but we all know funny. how that ended yeah. up. Anyways, the number two pick. So, <laughs> but um, we'll move on to something you know more Mike Leach because that's what we've been all yes. talking about on campus. So yes. recently he was asked about Colin Holiday's health. You know, I mean, it's been so many questions on it. He's been just getting it every time he gets an interview, and he finally gave us probably one of the best quotes we'll have from him <laughs> like, in his tenure. So. Referring oh, to his <laughs> his injury, is, any stuff on that is so closely guarded. I don't know if you saw Harry Potter, but in the basement of this building, it's guarded by serpents and wild dogs and things like that. You can go to find the secret to that, but chances of survival are always a risk. What does that even mean, yeah. Robert? Like, he's trying to relate yeah. an injury to I, Harry I Potter? How how does he, one even relate that? And to, and to end it all, he goes, heck. It took until movie five before he got it done himself, and he had magic powers. I don't know what he's talking about. I, this it, has nothing to do with anything. It's just Mike it, Leach being Mike Leach. Deflecting a, a question. Famous, <laughs> yeah. If he's anyone to deflect a question with any quote, I'm pretty sure Mike Leach just pre aced that. that was, well, I mean, you almost much. think it would be some, like, I don't know, maybe a pirate reference or something, and then boom, here Harry comes Potter. Harry Potter. Like, oh, my gosh. <laughs> I mean, hey, that's what we expected from Mike Leach, not the most char charismatic guy, but he'll give you quotes. I mean, he's a he's one character, you know, like, as I like to put it. Yeah, hopefully he'll give us these memorable yeah. quotes in the future. They're very fun, especially for the fans. Yeah, too. definitely. I mean, I obviously they're, up, they're quirky know, and but... goofy, but yeah, when I first – when I first read that and saw that quote, I was just, just, that was just unbelievable. I couldn't believe yeah. what, what he was saying. It just, yeah, I mean, um, I think that Mike Leach will give us a bunch of wins and a lot of quotes uh, for years to come, so yeah. I'm excited for your football. Definitely. Definitely. Well, guys, this is our last opinionated segment, so thanks for following us on Cube Nation yeah, this definitely. semester. Yeah, definitely. It's been fun. a lot of fun. Yeah, I mean, new experiences sure. for both of us being yep. talents on the show. And yep. Hope you enjoyed our opinion segment. Uh, leave comments. Follow us on Twitter. Yep. Uh, talk to us about Cougar Sports anytime because we'd love to. Yep. All right. Have see you guys. Have a good one, guys. Later.